Yeah, man, I'm gonna move to West Covina. I'm trying to start a family. I'm gonna knock my girlfriend up and just, just have a kid and just get out of here. That's a lot. Hey, team, ain't no new faces. Like, I can't breathe, like a blue face. Blue face. I saw me see it. This is what I woke up to this morning. Check it out. It's a movie, baby. Look at that. They even made fake parking spots. They should not keep they actually should kind of keep those. I don't know what's going on, but they got the whole nine yards out here today. They got all this, all this, this big old deflector, reflector thing, all these people. Just to film this guy walk from there to there. Oh, interruption. <laughs> Whoops. Action, baby. Look at that. Wait. Oh, he's not even walking across the street. He just goes there and stops. Beautiful. It's the magic of making movies, baby. Clearly. So, I mean, there's a movie and stuff going on outside. That doesn't really have much to do with what is going on today. Uh, update. You know, I haven't posted a video in like a week. So, first off, my apologies. I'm sure you guys are watching other people. So... You know, it's whatever. What I have been doing is every single day looking for apartments, but not actually going to them. Today is going to be the first day where I actually venture out to go check some out. So, of course, I figured I'd bring you guys along with the, the vlog, obviously, because why not? I need to not be in my apartment more. And when I spend so much at this, this place, it entices me to be here more. Just because I'm spending the money, I want to be at the apartment more. I don't know, it's a weird mental thing. So I'm going to get like a little cheapo little box, like a little cheapo El Boxo type of deal you know and uh and live there but uh yeah what am i talking about i don't know we're gonna go look at some apartments today yo i got towed it happened happened for real this time not like i'm gonna be able to stop it like my car is gone i have no defense this time it was my fault i admit the guilt i was lazy i left my car parked in a while in the same spot for too long now I gotta pay the price. Nice. Looks, uh, looks important. Looks very important. Yo. Yeah. Do you know the number of the tow company that oh, did they it? Told you already. I think so. Okay. I have to check, but I'm assuming I, have I did. Right here. Uh, diamond, uh, okay. Diamond tone. For sure. I knew it was yeah. coming. I was slacked. <laughs> yeah, my boss, hold on, my, my, uh, my supervisor was like, hey, the car, I told him because I went up there yesterday to do my round and everything, like, the car's still there. He's like, all right. So he just took the food. The, call, the office called the tow truck company. Ah, uh, okay. So, yeah. Yeah, pretty much my boss called the tow truck company. I knew it was coming, man, so no worries. Cool. I didn't even know that. I had a boot on my... Hello? Hello? Hi, uh, I'm, I'm looking for a white BMW that just got towed today, probably like an hour ago. From where? Uh, 821 South Flower Street, I think. Uh, I, I think that's the address. It's like a, a parking complex. That's me. Uh, what's... That's how much it'll cost? Oh, okay, hold on. Give me one second. Oh, 2440? Oh, yeah, that's what I said at first. Uh, 2420 what? F90031. And how much uh, cash should I bring to retrieve the car? 172 before 5 o'clock. 172. Okay, thank you, boss. All right. All right. Ooh, I thought it would be over $200. So that is, uh, that's, that's not too bad, man. 172 I can't accept I can't accept for my laziness 
One thing my dad taught me when I was growing up, man, is if you are lazy, you will have to pay the lazy tax from time to time. Today, I'm paying the lazy tax. Yeah. Now I gotta figure out how far away this place is. I also gotta shave. Some of y'all probably remember I used to park here all the time. Like I would park here pretty much every day. And I would leave my car here for like a week straight at times. Like have no problems. But then they caught on, or at least like the, the, the guy who owns it or something caught on and was like, yo, this guy can't park here anymore. So I stopped parking here for like four months. And I started again and I did the exact same thing. This time uh, they were less patient. Actually, I don't know. I was parked there for quite a while. Until today, probably like two. Cannot wait to get out of this place, dude. Just two more weeks. Two more weeks and I'm out. I'm gonna miss coming outside and seeing uh, massive camera cranes just chilling outside of my apartment. Just kidding. Cannot wait to go back to reality. Here's my ride. John, right? Yeah. Awesome. My workers to pressure management to take a stronger stand to get the farm job shut to last. How's it going, man? Good. I'm tired. Tired already. It's been a long day. How's your day going? Dude, I got my car towed this morning. Yeah. Really unfortunate. That's what I'm on the way to uh, retrieve. Have you ever had your car towed? No. Yeah. Part of life, right? Part of downtown LA life. Well, now we're headed to, uh, where is it, Echo Park? Something around there? Silver Lake? I love y'all. Yep. Do you live in downtown LA or whereabouts? Yeah. Nice. I moved to Covina two years ago, but I was traveling back and forth for the for my kids to be in school in LAUSD. But I, this one, this period, I'm moving over there because it's too much back and forth. Yeah, man, I totally agree. Living in LA is terrible. West Covina is nice. It's really nice. I like it out there. Okay, can't speak English. Uh, well. Nice to hear, man. Yeah, I can't wait to move out of here, dude. It's so hectic. Like, look at this. Look at this guy. Yeah. Look at this dude. Crazy. He didn't even know what he's doing. Where do you, where's that thing happen? Around here in LA or? Uh, me getting towed? Uh, yeah, I was right outside of my apartment, man. It's right, right, right there. I woke up and I looked at my car and I saw it. And then I was like, okay, my car is good. So I go and play video games, about 30 minutes. Yeah. Peek out again, boom, gone. So they told you car on the way over to Sugar Lake? Yeah, it's far, right? I don't know why, it's 20 minutes away. Yeah. They could have just, just, I don't know, I don't know. Yeah. $173? I think is what they said. I gotta check the footage. I gotta check the clip, but I think that's what it is. Something about that, man. You know? It's all part of the game. Yeah. Can't wait to move, though. Maybe I'll move to West Covina. That sounds nice. That does sound nice. It's nice over there. I mean, there's a lot of, not too many cars, but you can park in some areas if it is a Areas that they don't have, like a, where I live, it's okay to park, but during like two days, one side of the street, there's weeper pass and the other side. Yeah. So I just, um, you got more cars, you need to. Uh, okay, so it's like normal, like street parking, right? Like Tuesday, yeah. 9 a.m. Mm -hmm. That's, uh, if you, you don't have a, like a, if you rent an apartment and there's no space for you in there. You need to park on the street. Um, right. They do the city of Kupina, they give you permits. Oh. You can port yourself for. Dude, since I moved to downtown LA, I think I've acquired. I'm actually going to do the math to make this video about it tomorrow, but I think I've gotten $1,400 in parking tickets. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? 
$1,400. Yeah. 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 Like a two-monthly parking, I mean, payment on the plan for a car. Yeah. Right? Yeah. 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 That's over like 10 months, but still, that's a lot, right? Yeah, man, I'm gonna move to West Covina. I'm trying to start a family. I'm gonna knock my girlfriend up and just, just have a kid and just get out of here. That's a lie. But, uh, yeah, man, I gotta figure out where I can park my car. It's tough. It's tough. Yeah. Yeah, 60 bucks a month, basically. $15 every week, huh? That's not bad. I'd rather pay that than pretty much get $60 a, a week yeah. per tickets out here. Uh, <laughs> people like more friendly. Dude, people out here are really mean. <laughs> That's been my experience. Except for like a very tight group of neighbors that I've met, everyone else is very mean. Yeah. And I think I'm a nice guy, you know? I feel like I'm, I'm like, you know? I'm like normal. Yeah. But uh, everyone's really mean all the time. <laughs> Yep. Yeah, man. Torreon. I went to Torreon in 2009. I saw guys with pickup trucks, guns. But then I also saw the government. I think. I think I saw like. Because like I saw guys with plain clothes in the back of pickups with guns. And then I saw guys in like SWAT. Yeah. SWAT uniforms. And I assumed that was the government. Yeah. But I thought they were all the government when I went. I was, I was young. I was like 18 maybe. Yeah, I could have. I probably could have died, <laughs> or got kidnapped, or something. Yeah, at some point. Nothing happened. Ooh, look at that Tesla. We get, because sometimes it, they are shootouts. Hey, uh, you guys are still open, right? Pick up a car. Yeah, I'm. I'm here to pick up. Here we are, and there is my baby. Oh man, I knew this was gonna happen at some point, man. Should have been more cautious, should have been more. Ooh, look at this dock, I could ride this. Should have brought my bike in that Uber. Man, that guy has some good stories or what? That's probably gonna be a whole nother upload. That guy. I love hearing stories from people that are so genuine, you know, like that that guy, he's been through some shit. You can tell that. He's been through some shit. <sighs> so is this car, man. Second time I've been towed in a year. Come on, let me out, let me out. You work, dog? I don't see a dog. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. oh my god. Hello. Yeah, man. Oh, no worries. It's a healthy looking boy right there. Yeah. He's a great dog. Yeah. Thanks. Uh, this white BMW right here. I've been there. It looks like you've parked there for a while. I've been parked there for a while. Hey, oh, yeah, the, those guys at the lot, they're mostly my buddies, but the guy who owns it is not. Uh -huh. So once he caught wind of what's going on. Oh, those are cars you towed? No. Oh. Do you mind if I take a look? Oh, man, those things are crazy. Look at this collection. Stingray. SS. Another Camaro over there. What the heck? Camaros. Camaros on Camaros, huh? I see your Camaro guy. Look at the layers of neglect on this thing. You're getting a wash right now. Jesus Christ. Oh, 
I'm surprised this thing even started. A few things I need to take care of, service engine light. Replace a couple things on the interior and I am gonna get rid of this car, man. It's served its time. I've had it since 2013. 14, something like that, man. A cool, it's been about five years since I've gotten this car. It's, it has served its due. It's time to move on in life to greener pastures. This guy probably thinks I'm a psychopath because I'm just talking to myself into a camera. You know, I'm used to it. I'm used to it. I am kind of a psychopath. So, I'll take it. Oh my God. The dog almost. Oh my God. Uh, so, got my car back. Uh, I'm moving. I am moving very soon. I have a video. The next vlog you watch will be about that. Damn, I didn't upload an entire week. I just checked. I'm sorry. <laughs> if you want to interact on a more daily basis, though, click the first link in the description. It is a link to join the channel. If you join, you will be involved in daily live streams soon. Right now, I'll be doing them like every other day, but soon I'll be live streaming every day. Uh, to people who join it's like a new feature that just rolled out I guess some people if you have the new layout there's just a button that says join otherwise you can click on the first link and, and you get access to uh, live streams that nobody else gets to see where I will be having discount codes for the website hicksfam.com and maybe some other stuff I got to figure out what I'm allowed to do but I want to like give things away to people who are in the live streams I need to figure out if that's allowed apparently it's not but I'm gonna try and find a workaround if you already know I'll figure something out like but in the meantime if you want to support me during this process as I try to get back onto the daily grind uh, just feel free to click on that uh, it's really cheap it's only five bucks a month I think that's cheap you can join the live streams and ask me questions I'll be like super attentive and responsive any question you guys have I will answer in the live stream so yeah uh, yup Apartment shopping. You see this place? I'm leaving. Goodbye, LA. Well, goodbye downtown. It's gonna be somewhere else in LA, most likely. But, yup. Tomorrow, you will see where I move. Well, the beginning of the process of finding a place to move, or something like that. Either way, thank you for watching. See you guys tomorrow, or in the next upload. Hopefully, it's tomorrow. Peace. Like I can't breathe, like a blue face. I saw me see if you could take it out on Portaline, feel rejuvenate. All day I 